One after another, the members of the diplomatic community arrived at Sheraton Hotel Abuja for the pre enough dinner organized by National Council for Art and Culture for them. But before they were ushered into the hall, this photo session was first. The Director General of NCSU Otomo Oloshiko Roshi was said the essence of the pre inner was to provide an opportunity for members of diplomatic community to unwind, interact among themselves and the management of the NCSE and to also make inputs that will further enrich the content of the INAC Expo. For today is just a special recognition and welcome to tell you Nigerians love all of you, irrespective of your country, your interest, or class. I say, we love from Nigeria, all these countries, we love you, and we look forward to serve you. <laughs> this year, in Africa, is going to be special. I'm going to give every country that participated in Africa free of charge, we're not paying anything. The Dean of the Diplomatic Community in Nigeria, who is also the High Commissioner of Cameroon to Nigeria, Salah Hadin Abbas Ibrahima, thank NCC for honoring them and promise full participation of countries in the ESCO. It's a joke, but year after year, this becomes an institution. And uh, I like to say, we appreciate the vision that you put on organizing this paid enlightenment of the world. That's over. Dinner was served. The events feature a travel draw, exhibition of Nigerian arts and craft. The cultural icon also presented souvenirs to the envoys. Thank you. 
We have over 43 countries represented. 43 countries with over 29 ambassadors. What other better platform can you get to showcase the best of Nigeria? Today, tonight, we've been able to speak to the world. With all these countries present, we have shown to the world that some of the stories they read about Nigeria is not correct story. They could see that this country is peaceful. They could see that we are in harmony in Nigeria. We could have our challenges, but tonight, all the embassies will be telling their home countries that we had a wonderful dinner at the Sharatin on behalf of the Nigerian people. And they can see that if there's no peace in a country, if there's no harmony, we won't be having this kind of dinner. Mm. So for me, I'm very happy that we have been able to have the platform to showcase the strength of Nigeria as a people. The time has come, we must stop discussing our weaknesses and the threats among us. We should be talking about our strength and opportunities, which is what we have established tonight here. The 2022 edition of INAC Expo, which will be held on the theme Networking Nigerian Craft to the World, is scheduled to hold from the 18th to 20th of August 2022 in Abuja.